Hi everyone, this is Cash. In today's video, I will show to you kung paano ko ginagawa ang woke up like this look ko. So if you're interested to know it, please stay on my channel and I will show it to you right now. start with a clean face. So kahit anong gagawin mong makeup, or make sure that you start with a clean face. Wash it with your uh, products that you regularly use or kung ano man ang gagawin niya sa mukha niyo. Always start with a clean face. So I already did mine. I already washed my face with the cleansing foam I'm using every day. And now we are going to apply one of my favorites which is the Matte Rescue of Benefit. As you can see, medyo paubos na siya kasi favorite ko talaga siya. Ginagamit ko siya every day, every time I'm going to uh, put makeup on my face or even just a plain concealer or a BB cream. I'll, I make sure na meron ako nito. So, it's quite pricey. Pero, it's worth it naman. I think it's, I've been using it for like more than a month kasi or I think more than 2 months kasi hindi naman kailangan ganun karami yung amount na dapat mong ilagay. So, medyo sulit siya. It is pricey but you just need to use a very small amount of it. Ubus na siya actually. Kaya medyo kailangan ko na naman bumili. So, I'll show it to you. So, ito lang ah. Ganyan lang siya. Ganyan lang siya kakonti. Enough for the whole face. the primer. I use this Wet n Wild primer. Uh, why I use primer? Because I have a very oily skin. I'm a oily skin type person. So, kailangan ko ng primer. It helps to keep the makeup or whatever that is on my face to stay there. So, that's the purpose of the primer. For some, I think you don't need to use it. But it still depends. Kasi ako na sanay na ako naglalagay ako ng primer. So kung ano man yung gagawin ko sa mukha ko, uh, I make sure na I have a primer on my face. And by the way, Make sure not uh, not to overdo the primer kasi merong mga primer like what I'm using, this is a matte primer. So the more na marami kang nilalagay, the more the chances na magkikake yung mukha mo. So try not to overdo it. Small amount is just enough to spread it on the whole face. Make sure lang to put it on the areas na alam mong medyo uh, malakas ang pag-oil mo such as yung T-zone ko especially from the nose, even my eyelids. If you can have a separate primer for the, for, for the eyelids, it would be better. Uh, on my case, uh, sometimes I do that, sometimes I don't because I prefer to use just one primer. So, nilalagyan ko na yung eyelid ko since I have a very oily face. And another thing, make sure that you also have a clean hands. So, before you're going to put anything on the face, especially if you're going to use your hands, make sure na malinis ang inyong mga kamay. Okay? Okay, now we can go ahead with the foundation. I'll be using Essence Fresh and Fit Awake Makeup Foundation. This is going to be the first time and you, I'll use this. Kasi I've heard, as I saw in their Instagram uh, photos, ito ang pinakabago nilang foundation. So, why not try? Of course. Since it's, as I said from my previous video before, na nagkaroon ako ng uh, full face makeup using Essence and Cosmetics, Essence is very cheap. I got this for only 20 dirhams. Yes. This is a 30ml foundation in a glass 
bottle. Imagine, ang, ang ganda ng kanyang, uh, by the way, ang ganda ng kanyang packaging. Tapos, meron na siyang kasamang pump. So, medyo mas malinis siyang gamitin. Uh, you can uh, pump it directly on your face or you want to put it in here. So, you can just, you know, um, use it in a way na mas madadali ang cut. And, uh, yeah. So, mura lang siya. 20 dirhams. Imagine, it's, I'm not kidding. It's only 20 dirhams, ladies. So, why not try it? I'm uh, using shade, I mean the shade of number 10, which is Fresh Ivory. Sabi kasi nila yun yung kulay ko. Pero I think it's too light for me, which is okay lang. Kasi I've, as I've said before, mas kumukuha ako ng uh, one or two lighter shade than my skin. Kasi nga po, acidic ako, so the foundation tend to oxidize on my face. So once na nag-oxidize siya, nabuhulal ako. So, once na na-oxidize siya, um, mang mangingitin siya sa mukha ko. So, kailangan kong pumili ng one or two lighter shade from my skin tone. So, okay lang gamitin. And at the same time, most of the time, nagpukontour ako. So, yeah. Mas okay siya for me na lighter shade color. Okay, we'll go ahead with the foundation now. I'll be using a damp sponge for now, although I'm used to use a brush, foundation brush. Pero also a damp sponge will do because, as I can see, hindi siya matte, by the way. Hindi siya matte finish. So, I think it would be better if I will use a damp sponge. So, we'll go ahead now. brush na lang ako. <laughs> Ay, nakakot ka siya. You think it's been bago? Alam mo, ano siya, hindi siya full coverage. Kasi nakalagay dito, medium to full. So, siguro, if you want to make it full coverage, um, ano na lang, uh, kapalan nyo na nga lang. So, wala akong masyado nakikita ang difference kasi parang same skin tone ko nga siya. Very light. Konting-konti lang yung difference ko sa skin tone ko. So, kung hindi kayo ganun ka, ano, white katulad ko, this will do, I think. Ulitan ko, ha? I'll try to apply another layer kasi parang hindi ako masatisfy sa cover na. it's fine because the purpose of this video is how to look like you woke up like this. So, I think it will work on me. Feeling ko naman magmumukha siyang I woke up like this look. Means, I woke up like this look, it means that it should look simple. Hindi siya dapat sobrang kapal at hindi dapat sobrang obvious yung foundation. It should look like a very simple look. And I think it's okay. Ay, in fairness, ang ganda niya ha, nagsuhan ko siya. Kasi hindi naman sinabi dito na matte finish. Because as what it says in here, it's a healthy glow. So I was expecting it to look dewy. But surprisingly, that finish pala siya. And, that finish, but yeah, I can see some glow. I think I will probably use this after work. So what I did, dinagdagan ko na lang yung amount pinatungan ko ulit and what I like about it sa ngayon, sa nakikita ko hindi siya nag-click habang pinapatungan ko so that is another good point na hindi siya nag-click kahit pagpatung-patungin ko I think I did 3 layer <laughs> kasi medyo light na light siya or maybe because I'm using a sponge maybe next time I will use brush and let's see, baka mas mas spread out niya ng 
mas marami yung foundation. But so far, as I can see right now, okay siya. Um, I like the finish. It's a matte finish. The foundation itself pala, mukha ka nang I woke up like this. <laughs> Tapos konti sabog-sabog lang ng hair. Pwede na. So, <laughs> parang hindi ko na kailangan magkilo. Parang okay na to. Ganito na lang. <laughs> Pero anyhow, we'll proceed to our next step. Which is, konti lang ang gagamitin natin. Since uh, we are trying to achieve I woke up like this look, so gagamitin ko yung Maybelline Concealer. Age Rewind. Yes. Actually, favorite ko na siya. Kaya yun, nauubos ko na siya. Ang bilis ko siyang maubos. Wala pa atang one month mauubos ko na. By the way, this is the first video na, na ginawa ko sa bago namin uh, bahay. Dahil lumipad kami ng bahay uh, two weeks ago. Uh, and I love the fact na may window kami in, the, in our side. So, nagagamit ko siya. Nagagamit ko yung natural light and I like it. Kaya most of the time, I make a video in the morning uh, habang meron pang sunlight. Kasi napapakinabangan ko yung, yung, yung ilaw niya, yung natural light niya. Okay. Okay, so we can um, proceed now to setting powder. So, lagyan na yan ng powder yung mga ilalim ng mata natin. Dahil you want to look... Uh, woke up like this, look, na mukhang fresh. So, syempre, tatanggalin mo yung mga black circle natin dyan, sa under eyes natin, na pinagpapamura natin. <laughs> yes, ganun kabilis. So, next, sa ano na tayo, blush on na tayo. So, I will go with, I will mix two blush on. It would actually help, looks natural. So, I'll go with this peach and a little pink color in. I think I will use this one and this one. Okay? Eyeliner. It depends on you ladies kung gusto nyo mag eyeliner o hindi. I preferred to put a little eyeliner like a pencil line only. Hindi yung sobrang kapal. Just to have a volume in my eyes. On, or on my eyes. So, we'll put just a little amount. Konting konti lang. Some straight line lang. Let's see how it will look like. So, we'll be using Wet n Wild H2 Proof eyeliner. So, ganito yung loob na. Tingnan lang siya kamitis. Diba? So, as I said, thin line lang. Hindi sobrang kapal. Para hindi naman mag -over, magmukhang OA yung over na yung pagka woke up like this natin. So, yun na. Uh, kung gusto mo maglagay ng mascara, you can do that. Subukan ko tong essence. Uh, actually, matagal ko nang gamit to. I can suggest this to everyone. Um, I, I think this is 17, 15 year humps. 15 year humps, yes. Matagal ko na siyang gamit ever since. Uh, essence and Maybelline. Yun yung mga, especially Maybelline. Maybelline is one of the best mascara I've ever used. I will go ahead. We'll try to use it. I'm actually not planning to, to uh, put the mascara on. 
Pero since nabanggit ko na rin na pwede mo na rin, pwede naman din kayo magpagay ng mascara. Sige, lagyan na natin ng small amount lang. Ang problema kasi sa akin, uh, ladies, guys, kapag naglagay na ako ng mascara, adik kasi ako sa mascara, that's the problem. So, remember na may yung video ko na magpakasalon ako na plano kong magpa-eyelash extension kasi I love lashes. I love to have long lashes. And the problem is kung bakit nag-hesitate nag din akong gawin yun, it's because I also love mascara. So, if you have an eye, eye, eyelash extension, kapag nag-mascara ka, Siyempre, pag hinalamusan mo, kailangan burahin mo siya maigi. Ang tendency, kukuskusin mo maigi yung eyelash mo. And it will damage your extension, eyelash extension. So, uh, as much as possible, if you're going to have an eyelash extension, huwag ka na magigay ng mascara. The problem is, I love mascara. <laughs> so, I choose not to do uh, eyelash extension because at that time, I don't have enough time. And it's it's a bit pricey for 150 or or 150 dirhams depends dun sa length nung gusto mo ilagay. And yun na padalawang isip ako kasi I love using mascara and when I use it, <laughs> talagang makapal because uh, in fairness naman I have a long lashes kaya la kaya pag nag naglagay ako ng mascara ang tendency talagang kumakapal siya lalo. And ang um, ginagamit ko pa is yung for volume ising mascara. So, yun. Ang dami ko nang sinabi mo. <laughs> Sige na, lagay na natin to. Okay. Kapag gumagamit ako ng mascara, uh, medyo inaano ko siya, kinakayod ko siya. Kasi, masyado makapal. Actually, may dalawang kulay na itong, ah, uh, uh, ganitong uh, mascara ng, ng Essence Extreme. I love Extreme. Yung kulay blue. Yung kulay blue has a very nice ano, brush. Although this one is okay, pero if you're lo looking for yung brush na, alam mo yun, yung makapal na in-expect mo talagang makakapal at mahahaba ang mga ano niya, ang mga brushes niya. Um, yun, yung kulay blue ang kunin ninyo. mascara. I don't know if I should call it woke up like this. O baka, baka kailangan tawagin ko siyang selfie ready. <laughs> Kasi parang medyo, yeah. <laughs> I love the effect of this foundation talaga. It looks really healthy. Yun yung, yun yung name ng, yun yung slogan niya. Healthy Glow. Uh, where is it? There, Healthy Glow. Which is, yes, you look actually like you have a healthy glowing skin. Pero in a matte finish, I love the, I think I will use it at work. Ngayon, hindi ko nga alam kung dapat tawagin ko siyang woke up like this or a uh, selfie ready look. <laughs> Kasi medyo parang umuhoy na. <laughs> okay. So last, second to the last, what we should do is, of course, huwag kalimutan ang kilay. Should I put a kilay on? Kasi pag nagkilay ako, then it will not look like a woke up like this look. It will look like a ready selfie look. And mukha namang okay yung kilay ko. <laughs> Sige na nga. <laughs> Lagyan na rin natin ng kilay. Konting-konti lang. Hindi exage. Hindi sobrang on point. Hindi ko na rin siya nalagyan ng ng highlight or whatsoever, I'll just make sure to fill the empty uh, spots dun sa kilay ko. Kaya na ito. Yan, yung mga empty corner niya. So, yun na lang. Yun na lang lalagyan ko. Sige na nga, gawin na natin yung kilay. So, ayan, hindi ko na siya masyadong ginawang sobrang plakado na kilay kasi hindi naman tayo hahada. Okay, 
we're done now to the kilay so next last but not the least of course your lips so we're not going to use a lipstick we're going to use a lip tint to make it look simple so we'll try this one this very light color light pink lang siya so to look like fresh I'll stick with the woke up like this look because I like the fact that it, my face has a little shine uh, thing on an effect, little shiny effect from the foundation. Na I super like it. It turned out na para review na rin for this um, Essence Fresh and and Fit Fresh and Fit foundation uh, for a awake makeup healthy glow so i suggest i recommend this it really looks good on the skin as you can see right now i'm using a natural light from the window ito po ang effect niya sa face so it looks like you have a very natural glowing skin hindi man niya cover lahat ng imperfection ko but as i can see right now i like the effect so yeah this is how I woke up like this look like. My goal is just to have a woke up like this look. As you can see, hindi ko na inayos ang buhok ko. Kasi the goal is to woke up like this look. <laughs> so, wag mo na ayusin ang buhok mo. Mag selfie ready ka na. Para woke up like this look. <laughs> so, if you are going to try to achieve to have a woke up like this look, then this is how I do it. So, sana may natutunan kayo. Sana na-enjoy ninyo ang panonood ninyo. Like if you like the video. Dislike if you dislike. Comment down below. And click that button to subscribe. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye-bye!